I'm Steve Rendell from Haynes Publishing. Uh, I'm looking after the Robot Wars Build Your Own Robot Manual and we're here on the set of Robot Wars in Scotland. Uh, we've asked a few of the competitors to give us an insight into what goes on behind the scenes and their experiences of building their own robots. Sure. Uh, my name is Tom Lloyd. I am team captain of Team Tomco. Uh, I designed and built Bucky the Robot. Um, on my team I have Sabrina, I have Mo, and we have Bucky the Mascot. I had an idea to do sort of the opposite of a flipper. I wanted something that's going to snap down and clamp. Uh, thinking along them lines, I sort of got inspired by, you know, the chattering teeth, the comedy teeth. Um, and then I just I went for that and started at the top and kind of worked down. So it's, it's ended up looking quite unusual in terms of it's it's got no real chassis. Everything's kind of up in the air and the motors are kind of have to be stuck underneath to make the the jaw work. Um, uh, the pneumatics were new. From, uh, it was all new for me. Um, I'm a mechanical design engineer. So all the making the things move is fine. I design uh, pneumatic systems for low pressure. This is all high pressure stuff that was very difficult. Uh, it's very dangerous. So uh, getting that safe and stuff was all uh, a learning curve. And I also had to learn um, all of the electronics as well because I've never done any of that before. And that was, um, they can be, some of the components can be quite expensive and you can blow them up quite easily. So I found that. <laughs> Um, the, the live circuits are really good. If you go along to them, everyone's very eager to help you. Um, they put you in touch with lots of forums as well. Um, read lots before before you spend any money. Read lots. Read what everyone on the forum says about the parts. Read about the problems with them. Um, just make sure the bits are compatible with each other. Um, and Try and get some theory in there. Don't, don't just sort of build it as big and powerful as you can because you end up destroying yourself. Um, yeah, just do your research before you spend your money, really. Being part of Robot Wars, that is the highest being here. So walking in, it's very surreal. You walk in, it's massive, and it's like they've emptied the TV in front of you. Um, and there's all these people, you're like, there's all these people around that you're like, I know you, I know you. And that, that's really cool. I, um, I just wanted the, I like the instant sort of action of a flipper, but I didn't want to do something that someone else has already done. So I thought I could go the opposite, complete opposite of a flipper and try and have something that's got that quick action, but, but downwards and use that as a clamping, biting. And then like along them lines, so I made a, giant mechanical set of teeth.